What's up guys, here with a deck profile from Nikki Goldman who just topped ARG Las Vegas with Kagero. And let's get started. Uh, so I played Overlord for this event, it's just one of the best decks in the format. Uh, for the start I ran Conroe, it, it just helped me search all my ones or even heals, just anything I needed. One of the best starters in Kagero and the game. Uh, four heal, healing is an essential part of Vanguard, and the counter charge soul charge is really important. Uh, I ran 6 crit, uh, 4 being the one that can retire when something else is retired. Uh, it really just helped on uh, especially my opponent's turn, because right now it's not eroded, and I don't know if it will be, it probably will, but it just helped uh, retire stuff on my opponent's turn with my, when I did retire them with my G-Guards. And then I ran uh, 6 draw. Uh, four Gatling Claw just for the starter retirement early on consistency, <laughs> and then three of this just puts a soul plus three. Uh, this deck needs a lot of soul, so that's why. Uh, that's all. That's it for my triggers. Grade ones, I run four PG on flip PG, best one in right now. The the dungeon or whatever, it's absolute garbage. I really don't like it. Uh, and this deck needs this counter blast too. Uh, three Stride Fodder. This deck does stride. Sometimes you don't want to just trigger your threes. Uh, three Conroe helps you search your threes, especially when you need to get to Destiny. And then uh, you can search this off with Conroe. With Conroe. <laughs> uh, it helps you counter charge too. And just put your grade threes back to... Uh, uh, it puts them to the drop zone for this. And this puts two, of, two grade threes back and lets you draw. So it just helps you plus. And if you get one of these and two of these, two Conroes... You can really rush early game, and uh, the stride, the on the, sh the one that helps you stride, the effect that helps you stride is kind of irrelevant, but it's useful at some times. But usually it's just dead. <laughs> uh, for grade twos, I ran four Nahalem. It's just a free sixteen k attack when you're striding, or uh, a free twenty one attack when you attack with like Ziegenberg or Ace. Uh, really nice to have. Uh, four k, four ten k, uh, overlord things. Uh, the minus five k is kind of irrelevant because as long as it's ten k on your opponent's turn, that's like absolutely fine. Uh, the gaining power is just free, so good. Uh, and then I run four of these. Uh, also gains power, but it retires early on in the game. So that's and that's all that matters. And just for uh, grade two gaming and uh, yeah, it just helps me grade two game. That's really it. Uh, for the main grade three destiny, uh, the soul blast to kill or resist or like anything, and but it can kill resist is just really really good, especially with Thavis in the format. It's really helpful and it's just really free, where you can add a grade three to hand. And then I ran three end and one X. <laughs> uh, well, this is just for like after Drachma turns. It never really came up because if I Drachma, it's usually, it's usually game. But the three end is just for early game if it ever comes up. It didn't really, it never really came up, but it probably will if I do play against uh, like grade two decks, grade one decks, you know. And it's really deadly when it gets pulled off. For strides, I ran. Uh, this thing, <laughs> this uh, it just helps clear my board, and it's a really or clear my opponent's board, and it's really it's really good first try because the deck doesn't really have a good really good first try. That's uh, when you don't have that much counter boss. Uh, three ace. Now I run three because you can first try this with four counter boss open, but usually I just use one as unflip fodder for either this or purge, and then just have the two uh two for later. Uh, but that's really it. Uh, three Ziegenberg. Or, yeah, Ziegenberg. Uh, free resend, so I'll sit. And, uh, yeah, free resend. <laughs> Sometimes I unflip this. Uh, two purge. Um, it makes my opponent take a damage and just gains drive strikes for free. It's absolutely nuts. Uh, it lets you just gain card advantage for nothing. And it's also an overload, so you're. Your cards gain power. And then one Drachma. Well, this card 
I do go on this card a lot. Uh, it's a really good finisher, uh, especially when like they they have low card count in hand, or you they're running a low count of grade threes, which is a lot of decks in the format right now. Uh, so that's it for like the strides, and uh, something that is questionable is that I'm running six G guards, uh, three being Denial Griffin which is really useful against a lot of decks. And then one unflip G-Guard, which is basically a Denial Glyphron, but Soul Blast and unflip. Uh, Defeat Flare, which helps clear my ba their opponent's back row. And then this just gains a bunch of power. Uh, now all of these are very situational and that's why I run six. And uh, I don't really need more strides that I can attack with. And uh, yeah, that's it. Uh, shout out to Ultra Pro and PPG. Uh, shout out to Atik, Mo, uh, Chris, Justin, Ben. Uh, <laughs> yeah. Daniel, Daniel. Yo, he lent me the deck. He's a cool guy. <laughs> Alright, peace.